subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos hey what's up beauty of this is wasi here and today in this video i'm going to show you how you can check that the phone you have bought new or used is pta approved or not so the process is quite simple and easy but many people don't know about it so i'm going to show you in detail how you can check that the smartphone you have is pta approved or not so let's begin the video so before i tell you that how you can check that your phone is pta approved or not let me just first tell you why it is very important so if your phone is not pta approved in pakistan then you cannot use cellular services on your mobile phone say this uh, this mainly applies on the mobile phones that come uh, across border from pakistan like if you got a phone from like america dubai etc and you can you would like to use cellular services in pakistan then you can do so but only for 2 months after 2 months the cellular services will be banned on your phone and you need to pay tax to pakistan government in order to get it pta approved and then you can use uh, cellular services in pakistan over the whole lifetime of that phone so here is my phone so it doesn't matter whether you have a iphone like here i have the iphone 7 plus or if you have any android phone or you have an huawei phone the process is same for all the mobile phones so the first thing that you need to do is to check the imei of this phone so to check the imei imei of any phone it's very simple all you need to do is to open the call dialer here you need to type star hash 06 hash and you can see it will automatically open the device info here you can see the imei number of this phone and the meid so if your phone has dual sim then you are going to have two imei of that phone since this is an iphone and it has only one sim so it's showing only one imei number so what you need to do is to uh, write this imei number anywhere on any books etc or you can take a picture from another phone i'm just going to take a screenshot right here i'm going to press on cancel so now what you're going to do is you need to uh, write this imei number on pta's website to check whether it is pta approved or not meaning that whether tax is paid for this particular phone or not so you're going to open any browser either on your phone or any laptop or computer it doesn't matter so here i'm going to open google chrome so here i'm going to type d i r b s and uh, it will be automatically given d i r b s i m e i check you're going to press on here and you're going to see this first site where it says d i r b s dot p t a dot g o v dot p k so this is the official p t a website so we're going to open this website also guys i will put this website's link in this video description as well so you can simply go and click the link and this website will be opened up automatically so here you are going to go down here it says check status of your device and here you are going to enter the 15 digit of your imei number again the imei number was the one that you uh, found through the call dialer that was star hash 06 hash so here is the imei number so i am just going to type my imei number here quickly so after typing the imei number of this phone i am going to press on i am not a robot so here you need to check the traffic light in my case it will be different in your case next crosswalks there aren't any here so i'm going to press on check and here you can see we are going to go down and here we have the device status as you can see your mobile imei which was the imei of this phone uh, compliant pta approved slash registered so it means that this particular phone is pt approved and the tax has been paid for this phone if you get an option that this pta this device is not registered on pta that means that that particular mobile phone is not pta registered and you need to pay tax so whenever buying a non pta phone in the market its price is usually low as compared to other phones in the market so here it will show you its model as well as you can see apple iphone 7 plus and its model number So here you can get a complete detail whether your phone is IMEI or PTA approved or not. 
so guys if you like this video please give this video a thumbs up if you have any kind of questions regarding this video write them in the comment section below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so other than that thank you for watching and stay safe